Yeah, once again, uh, the pressure <laughs> is Michael on. Kyrie once and again, Amy Nodin. the two guys in the front from the advanced class. Bike number triple five. Azizu Kyrie okay. and bike number four. Bike number four. Amy okay. Nordin. Here they come rounding the last corner. Let's see. Confirmation it is 555 five, five, leading number four. Azizu Kyrie from Amy Nodin. Uh, Shafi Ashraf dropping further back. But uh, Akmal Hisham has passed everyone and moved up to P4. Did he start like way down in the grid? Yeah, he started from 13. Wow. So, uh, we're going to see anyway, if there was it's any... Fatah Ismail leading Kieran Ng, yeah? There Fata was any Ism jump start there for uh, Akmal Hisham. Ah. But if it wasn't, there was a fantastic uh, start for bike number 86. And yes, as Faisal mentioned, for the EVO class, uh, Ahmad Fatah from Singapore is now leading the way from Kieran Ng in six. Yeah. And Adian Yin up to P3 in class, seventh overall at yeah. the moment. Li Long in eight, in 15 is Aaron Tay, in 10, Brian Key. There you go, in third and fourth, bike 23 and 86. Race leader is still bike triple five, Azizul Kairi or Ejoy with Amy Nodi in P2. Taking into turn one and two, it's still so triple five. So we have five. a two-way battle here for the win in race two. And in the back of them, I think we can see a two-way battle as well for third between uh, Shafi Ashraf and Akma Hisham. Ak Akma Hisham. So Whoa. these are the four advanced riders. Different lines from the two riders. Uh, we have the four advanced riders both in two different battles uh, for P1 and also P3 in the front. Azul Kairi defending from Amy Nodin this time round. They both are lapping constantly in the uh, 53s with Amy Nodin slightly faster than Azul Kairi. Yep, I would say the rider that lost out in the opening lap is Reiko Chai. He has dropped down to 12, so he started 8 uh, he, on the grid. He's had quite a weekend, yeah? With the, uh, the damage on his bike earlier in the Super Roco race. Yeah, then so he had to ride a borrowed bike. He's not even uh, racing on his bike here in race 1 and race 2. So here is a big group battle. I see Adian uh, holding off Lee Yi Long. Yes. And uh, Aaron Tay. So this is the battle for P7. P7, but third in class. So 69 leading um, 15, Aaron Tay. Still leading. There you go, bike number 69 onto the infield straight. Yep, and I think you have uh, Steven Tang in the battle there yes, as well with Steven Brian Tang. Key. So, big group of them. Uh, and these guys were all uh, in the rookies class in season one. So, this is the battle for Evo right now between uh, Adian, Aaron Tay, we see uh, Yi Long in there, Steven Tang, Brian that's, Key. That's a huge group. Yeah, this is a big mid-pack battle here for P7. Okay, confirmation. Azil and Amy Nodin cross the start-finish line with Shafiq Ashraf and Akman Hisham. Yep. Abdul Fatah still leading in the Supermoto Evo with Kieran Ng chasing him hard. Yep, so the four advanced here comes Adian Yin. The four oh. advanced riders are in the in front. Into turn one. I think that is... Yi Li Lung. Yi Lung, Yi Lung, Lung passes Adian. Adian. P7 from Adian. Behind yeah. him is also Steven Tang and Aaron, Aaron Tay. Tay. So Aaron Tay lost out. He was hounding Adian earlier in the previous lap. Yeah, but I would say it's not over. I think we have uh, still one, two, three, four, five, six, six. Six, <laughs> yes. six way battle for P7 here with six laps. P7 so. overall, but P3 in class. Adian now fighting back. So Adian still trying to chase. Uh, Yi Lung, who passed him in the previous lap, but now under attack from Steven Tang. Yep, and we can see, I think, Kira Ng right ahead of this entire group as well in P6. Yes, Abu Fatah still holding station, still P1 for Evo with Kieran Ng in P2. Here comes Adian and Yi Lung. Yi Lung. Oh, Adian drops further back behind Tang. Yeah, I think now Aaron Tay as well trying to squeeze on the inside <laughs> of uh, Adian. Very, very heated battle in very the mid pack there as uh, Azizu Kairi. I can see into turn uh, three, yes. Off Emi Nordin. Aaron Tay trying to pass Adan into turn four. They are about, I think, half a lap ahead of this group that we're seeing on screen. Yeah, looks like another change in the position there for P3. Yi Lung and Steven Tang battling it out. 56 and 8B. So all 
Level 4 Advanced Rider completes a, completed another lap. Here comes Abdul Fattah, leader for EVO. Yeah, so he has quite a comfortable lead right now from uh, our championship leader, Kieran Ng, by Indeed. number 151. And crossing the line here by number 56 with uh, Stephen Tang right behind him. So now a teammate battle here for both Wee Biker like Tom's racing riders. Yilong and uh, Steven battling out for 7th position overall and 3rd position for the Eagle And it looks like they are dropping Adian behind even further, who's now defending from Aaron Tay. Yep, so that is a P. Adian now in 9th, Aaron in 10th. Uh, Reiko has made up 1 position from Brian Key, so Reiko now moves up to 11th. We have 3 laps to go. Azul no, Kairi is still defending yeah, no hard from Amy Nodin. No changes in the front from our top six so far. I think Amy Nodin is just uh, timing him his move. But he's been shadowing uh, Azul Kairi all race long. Yep, and Abdul Fatah in a comfortable lead for the Evo class. Uh, Aaron Tay to turn one ahead of Adian tries to outbreak Adian bike number 15 over 69 but Adian tries to fight back and right behind we can see Reiko Chai so yeah, it's quite obvious he has the bright pink uh, rims yeah board bike right yeah from Marcus Lee in the super rookies so here we go now Ray, uh, Adian coming under pressure from Reiko Chai Again, Azul Kairi and Amy Nodin, they cross the start finish line together and very close to each other. Shafi and Ashraf round up the Supoto Advance and Akmal Hisham. So things looking very consistent in the front for the top four Advance riders. As we see, I think Abdul Fatah going to come around to lead the Evo class by uh, number 38. Very comfortable lead over Kieran Ng. And then here comes Yi Lung and Steven Tang. Very close battle as well. Adian moves, lose another position to Reiko. Yep, Reiko goes an inside in turn one. Oh, but Adian fights back. Oh, no, not quite. And he takes P10 from uh, Adian. And Brian Key now right behind Adian. So a lot of uh, defending uh, for Adian laps to go here in race two. Final lap. Race leaders are on the final lap. Azul Kairi defending from Amy Nodin who's been hounding him all race long. And on camera here is the battle for third. So this is Shafiq Ashraf. And Akmal Hisham and Akmal in P4. Hisham. So Akmal Hisham who had a superb start. Starting from P13. And we're back to our race leader. Yeah. So here we go. Bike number triple five. Triple five is number Kairi. four. Azul Kairi leading bike number four. So he, uh, uh, he started from pole position, has been uh, in the lead throughout the entire race with Amy Norton right there behind him in second. So Amy probably waiting for Ejoy to make a mistake, but, but so here far they come on plus the last corner. From our race leader. Here comes Azul Kairi takes the check and flag and the final win of the year for Supermoto Advance. So congratulations to Ejoy for another victory here in his first full season in the Supermoto Evo. Riding so very for NK Racing, right? Very delighted at Ejoy, very valuable points for NK Racing in the Battle League Team Championship as well. Amy Norton finishes a very strong second. Abdul Fatah takes the checkered flag for Supermoto Evo with Kieran Ng in P2. Hey, hang on. It's Yi Long. Where's Kieran Ng? Kieran Ng has dropped down. No, I see him cross the finish line. I think we always have issue with, with Kieran's uh, transponder, transponder ah, because okay. I did see him cross the finish line right behind uh, Abdul Fatah. Okay. So, so it yeah. should be a uh, second for should be second in uh, class. Kieran, followed by Yi Long, Steven, Aaron, Reiko, Adian, Brian. Uh, the Brian ha in and Brian 11. Key, then uh, Haikal. Oh, Brian uh, yeah. in 12. Haikal in 13. And uh, once again, fight coming did not start the race. Yep, okay, so, so... This is your provisional results for race 2. Uh, win goes to Azizu Kairi in the advanced class, followed by Amy Noreddin, Shafiq Ashraf and Muhammad Akmal Hisham. For the EVO class, victory goes to Abdul Fatah. Uh, doing a burnout in the pit lane there. Followed by Kieran Ng, Lee Long, Stephen Tang, Aaron Tay, 
Ray Gochai, Adian Yen, Brian Keane, 12, and Haika Rudin wrap things up in P30. <laughs> okay. So that wraps it for Season 2 for the Supermoto Advance and Supermoto Evo. So coming up next, we have our final race. Final race of the day, final race of Season 2. That is the most anticipated... Yes, uh, the, big the big boys. Race 2 for the All-Stars Pros and All-Stars Legend. Once again, we'll be seeing on the grid uh, some of the top Malaysian two wheels Riders such as Hafiz Sharan Abdullah, Aslan Shah Kamar Zaman, uh, Adam Nordin, Kasma Daniel, Ibrahim Nordin. We also have our championship leader Daniel Haikal, Louis Cornish, and so many more big names that will be joining us on the starting grade for the All Stars Pro and All Stars Legend. So don't go anywhere and stay tuned for the final race of season two. We'll be right back after a break. We've got some fresh new young talent doing some things that I know you haven't heard before.